stomach is home to 300 to 500 different kinds of bacteria containing nearly 2 million genes. Paired with various other tiny organisms like viruses and fungi, they make what's known as the microbiota or the microbiome. Now, for years, the bacteria were considered as organisms to avoid. Mind it? It turns out that bodies are already loaded with trillions of bacteria. They also help digest food and play an important role in your well-being. Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues, your daily dose of health and medical news. I am Dr. Nandita Mohan and I am going to discuss about the newly found rare benefit of gut bacteria that leads to no control of hypertension. A new study from the University of Toledo College of Medicine and Life Sciences has shown that gut bacteria can reduce the effectiveness of certain blood pressure drugs. The research that I am talking about, published in the journal Hypertension, it offers the first clues to what has been an elusive mystery. Why do some people not respond well to medication? The question still persists. High blood pressure is often called a silent killer because it doesn't usually cause symptoms. However, there is a big number of population of individuals who know they have hypertension but still cannot get it under control even though they are taking multiple blood pressure drugs, thereby causing a major concern. Among those with high blood pressure, an estimated 20% have what's known as resistant hypertension, meaning their blood pressure remains at high levels despite aggressive treatment. The only way to manage this by doctors is these patients is adding or switching medications and increasing the current dosage with the hope that they can find something that works. Until now, they haven't had any clear indication what the mechanism is for resistant hypertension. In recent years, the researchers have more intently examined the link between an individual's blood pressure readings and the unique collection of bacteria that lives in their gut. However, this is the first study to examine this association, that is the impact of gut bacteria on blood pressure medication itself. U Toledo scientists, they compared the effectiveness of the antihypertensive drug Quinapril with normal gut bacteria against those whose gut microbiota had been depleted by high dose of antibiotics. The researchers found a clear difference between the two, with those who were given antibiotics first responding much better to quinilapril. That's all for today. Stay tuned to Medical Dialogues for latest updates. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.